I play the banjo. I drink a bang energy drink to start every day. And I think Taylor Swift is overrated. Howdy, Big 12 friends. Great to have you. Drake Toll here from Locked On Big 12 and ESPN Central Texas. And I want to say thank you for making Locked On Big 12 your first listen every single day. Recording this after a weekend, I am blown away by the reception already. You have made my life as a 22-year-old podcast host, green around the years, new to life, happy with everything around me, very good. This has been great. What a gratifying, gratifying position already. I love the passion of the new eight, the grateful eight. I love the sass of the hateful eight, and I love being in the fat middle of it. It's beautiful. This conference is it is the best. And I want to introduce you a bit to myself before we get too far into this thing. I told you, just 22 years old, from a small town of Valonia, Arkansas, population 3,000. It was my dream to work in sports media. And here I am, <sighs> covering the best conference in the land. And I am I feel so blessed for the opportunities that I've gotten and the opportunity to talk to you every day. I promise you're going to get my best. I graduated from Baylor University in the spring of 2023 and hit the ground running immediately after hosting Locked On Baylor for well over a year and a half. When I got the call about Locked On Big 12, it was no question a yes, because I love the league. Being around the league for five football seasons have fallen a love in love with the unique nature of this conference. It's not the SEC. It's not the Big Ten or the ACC or the Pac-12 or the Mountain West. It's its own entity that I think does it better than anybody else. I mean, you can make the case the SEC has the best football, but I'll withhold from that one. And I'll say, I don't know if the Big 12 can be beat in the fun factor. <laughs> That's why I'm here. Man, I, I'm, I'm grateful. I'm grateful in week one to be number 98, uh, the 98th best sports podcast on Apple Podcasts and number 22 football podcast on their platform as well. Every bit of this has blown me away and I can't wait. Look, I want to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of year one. We have less than a year now to do it. I want to hit 5,000 Twitter followers with the Locked On Big 12 account. I've got some big dreams and some big goals. I'm going to make you mad at some point. I'm going to put out a power ranking. I'm going to rank the quarterbacks. I'm going to say whose jerseys suck, and you're going to get upset with me. But law of averages, not everybody in this league can be number one. And you might not like me, but I'm going to call it like it is. I'm going to tell it as I see it. No matter what, I can promise you that much. I'm I, I, I'm going to give you my honest opinion. Love it or hate it, I hope you'll stick around for it and make this Locked On Big 12 your first listen every single day. Thanks for a great first week. Let's keep going. It's only going to get better from here. And I promise you're going to love it. And if you don't, let me know. Feedback is a gift. And I want feedback whenever and wherever it comes from, whatever it is, even if it's those pesky TCU fans, this is this is going to be big. This has been and always will be. See you on Monday. Locked on. Big 12.